Today, you will be trying noodles from seven different countries, and you'll have to guess where each is from. If you get more right, then you win a big trophy. Whew. Oh, yes. And if you guess more wrong, then you'll have to face a punishment. Noodle number one. This is uh, probably some pasta here. I don't get it, but it looks kind of like layered, kind of like a thicker pasta. Get a smell of like teriyaki on it. I think the noodles, they taste a little sweet. It's almost kind of like a little bit of gravy flavor to it. Not like American gravy, but just, but I like all of the combination. I, I like this whole entire plate because it's got the, the celery, the broccoli, either the spinach or the kale, and it's got the chicken and, and the noodles. So this is a, this is a very a, a tasty dish. It's got a good flavor. That pasta is really good, nice and soft. Okay. Tiene sabor chino por sus uh, condimentos, aunque también puede ser filipina, ¿me entiende? Porque tienen cierta cultura. It's China. That's what I think. Just freaking busted. <laughs> Patsyu from Thailand. Come on, man. That was my next. That was my next guess. Noodle number two. The plate here looks like we got, it looks like rice. All right, well, what, what I thought was rice is are actually small, thin, white noodles. Some noodles almost looks like angel pasta hair, uh, but not really. It's very refreshing. I could taste the uh, peanut in it and the sweetness of the this dressing here. It's really good. The noodles by themselves, I think, would be just a little bit too bland for me, but the whole entire meal is very refreshing. It's very healthy. Something that I would probably enjoy, you know, over, you know, having like a light lunch or something like that. Yeah. Nice and refreshing, nice and cold, nice and cool for a nice hot day. And I think the, the country that it came from is Vietnam. Pero, me la sensación de, por su condimento, me la sensación de vietnamita. I think it's China. Vermicelli noodles from Vietnam. Damn it. Noodle number three. I mean, it looks like like lo mein. It looks like chow mein, soft noodles. It looks like chow mein. Does it mean that it, it you know, it just because it looks doesn't mean it, it is, right? A lot of people put a twist to theirs and it looks like this. This is very tasty. I like the 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 lightness, the airiness, the the savory chow mein. You know, some people call them lo mein, some people call it chow mein. Quiero poner un mexican. I think I got this one right. Yeah. I think so. <laughs> but I think this is chow mein and I, and I think that the, this is, I think this is Chinese, you know? That would be my guess. So I would say we're visiting China right now. Fideos chinos, ¿verdad? Que siempre vienen, uh, ¿cómo llama? Acompañados con su repollito. Bam! I'm dropping the mic, double. Chow mein from China. Ooh, baby! Noodle number four. There's eggs, there's corn, it looks like chicken here. There's a very kind of like aromatic smell to it. It reminds me of, of caldos, you know? I can smell the the ginger in this sucker. It smells so good. Yeah, there's like a, an aromatic warmth to this soup. This meal's very, very warm uh, on a cold night. Um, and I think it's ramen. Darn good soup. Like that ginger hit right there. Really strong. Noodles were really good. Chicken goes very well with it. Now I have to guess where it's from, huh? Yep. So I'm thinking that this is ramen. It's It's got a lot of really nice uh, composition, nice colors, and it's very, it's got the noodles, it's got the veggies, it's got the egg, it's got the chicken, it's got the broth, so it's got, you know, it's very impressive. Es parte de su cultura, el colorido, y el sabor rico, o sea, la magia de sus sabores. So you know what? We're gonna go that route. Ramen from Japan. It's ramen? Way to go, you're messing me up here. Noodle number five. I don't see the vegetables and the colorful aspects from the ramen, but it's uh, it looks a little bit more simple. A brothy uh, smell to it, almost like a warm tea. These noodles, they li it looks like like s little tiny sea monsters or something, like like little white worms, you know, right? It seems like if the, um, the noodles are on steroids, like this is the big brother to all the other noodles earlier. It's uh, nice and Thick noodle. The noodles are chewier. The noodles are thicker. I like the caldo. I like the broth. You well? Okay. Fíjate que estoy entre dos. 
Ooh, nice, nice flavor to that. Wow, it's nice and sweet. It's got a nice teriyaki sweet flavor to it. It's really good. If I'm to guess a country, I'm leaning towards the Philippines, but I'm not too sure. But it, it, yeah, but so I'm gonna go with with that. I'm gonna go with the Philippines on this. A lo mejor le fallo, pero sabes que voy por Filipinas, porque son ricos en gustar la carne de puerco. Let's guess because this is a guessing game right now, and I guess I suck at guessing. Came from China. That's where it started, and then it ended up in Japan. So I'm gonna go with China though. Udon soup from Japan. They're from Japan. Wow, okay. Noodle number six. Esta te lo recomiendo cuando tengas la pasta así al siguiente día, ya después de que guisa y todo, te recomiendo que estés unos huevitos, la guises en mantequilla y estés unos huevitos arriba. I need some cheese and some, need some chili flakes, right? Because this looks like traditional spaghetti with meat sauce. Uh, where are the meatballs at? Oh, what about some, some, some sausage? Can we get some sausage on here? You get some meatballs or something, you know? Whether it's American or Italian and the origin of it, right? Uh, that That's uh, kind of debatable here. It's a tough one. Um, I am a spaghetti guy. I really love spaghetti. Yeah, this is good. I like this. I mean, I can, we could eat this all day long. You know, you taste the, 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 the marinara, the, the, the meat sauce, the tomato sauce. That's definitely spaghetti. Definitely. I'm gonna go with. See, I had you guys, huh? I'm going go with it, it, Italia. Con la comida okay. italiana. Come on, Arturo. Italy. It's almost Mexican. Bam, I'm winning. All right. Spaghetti from Italy. I'm good at this game. I am good at this game. Noodle number seven. Light, light in color, almost like a, like a, a transparent kind of look to them. They're a little thinner than what I'm used to. Uh, I've never I've never tried this. Uh, I, I can say that I don't think I've ever tried this. Well, this one definitely looks familiar, but uh, could I pinpoint from where? No, not really. I should know it, man. I should know it. They're a little drier than all the other noodles that I've tried. This got like a sweet kind of honey flavor to them. There's a little blandness to them at first, but then the, 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 sweet, the sweetness comes in later after you kind of start savoring it in your mouth. So I think the sweetness comes in a little bit later, but it's pretty good. I, I, I mean, I like it. It's got a great taste, that's for sure. Nice and sweet, a lot of onion in there. It's either the Philippines or Thailand, but I'm gonna go with the Philippines, I think. I'm gonna go with the Philippines. Bro, I'm overthinking this. Damn, I don't know why, I don't know why. All right. Japche from Korea. Korean, wow. Noodle number eight. Very thin, almost like Fidel, like Mexican Fidel. They're not sticking together and they're not clumpy. What a curveball. So it's like an angel hair pasta again. Again, very refreshing, very light, savory. I could maybe taste a little bit of maybe ginger, maybe garlic. They remind me a lot of Vietnamese noodles, to tell you the truth. No es dulce, ni es salado. Tiene su neutralidad, está neutro todo. Está muy rico. It's got a nice, it's kind of like a peppery. It's very peppery. It's got a good flavor. I'm thinking that it's a possibility of Vietnamese or Philippines, but I'm gonna go with Viet Vietnam. Este me huele más a, a filipino, ¿me entiendes? Oh. Bonset <laughs> <sighs> from the Philippines. Hey! Oh my God. I'm the winner! Pero este es que... El que me... Es el que me llevo. Es el que me llevo. Que... Esta es la consolación. Oh my God. Damn, man. And I got the worst freaking jelly bean you can get. 